Here with Concordia head women's soccer coach Greg Henson after a 6 nothing win over Presentation College to remain undefeated in, in conference play. I know it's a, a little bit different feeling in, in a game like this coming off of Hastings and, and uh, I know you you don't want your players to get caught up in what the other team's record is. How did you keep them focused tonight? Yeah, just really just talked about that specifically about, you know, it doesn't matter how uh, how a team's performed in the past um, or how we performed against a team in the past. And it just matters about uh, coming out and making sure that we secure uh, the victory and, and get three points in the game. Um, that's what this time of year is all about is every game that we go out, we got to find a way to win. we got to find a way to get three points in the standings and continue to progress towards our goal um, for the end of the year. Um, and, uh, you know, presentation, you know, it's been on a little bit of hard times of late. Uh, the record reflects that, but uh, but, but they're, not a, they're not a bad program in terms of players on the field. they got some players that could be dangerous. So, you know, we just wanted to make sure that we came out and, and challenged them and tasked them with coming out with the same intensity, same motivation, same attitude, same drive that we did on Wednesday against Hastings. Um, and really try to do that against every opponent we play regardless of, uh, of what their standings are, what their record reflects. Well, you really dominated with your starting 11 on, on the field and, and they were able to then get uh, a lot of players in, off the bench into the game. But what, what did you like maybe about that, that first group tonight? Yeah, I mean, we wanted to come out and get off to a good start and really kind of try to put the game to bed early. Um, and obviously scoring a goal 40 seconds into the match or whatever it was, you know, really kind of set the tone there. And, and then uh, throughout the first half, just wanted to continue to build on that. And, and they kind of try to set, it, set in a little bit, and we know we're going to face some teams that will do that to us as well. So it's, it's just kind of another opportunity to get out and play and, and work together and gel together. And, and I thought we did uh, a nice job of just maintaining possession and controlling the, the game in the first half. And, and in the second half, uh, you know, we went to send the starters back out for a little bit um, and just kind of gave them a, a challenge uh, for them and told them they were going to have limited minutes so we could get the rest of the team in off the bench and, and got a lot of players in and got a lot of players' minutes. And that's going to be important for us as we, uh, you know, wind down the conference season uh, for those players to get some game action um, in conference games here in October um, and be ready uh, when their name or number's called later in the year. How do you like the, the way things are progressing with your attack? You have some players that have put up some pretty nice numbers. Dieter's into double figures and goals now, and, and Sadath has eight. You got the, uh, at least was the national assist leader with Lauren Martin, but they seem to be doing some really good things on the attack. I think this year's team, different than, than a lot of teams we've had in the past, is just that it's very balanced scoring, and we've got a number of different weapons. Um, that uh, that can provide opportunities for us to score goals, whether it's Dieter, uh, whether it's Suds. Uh, Lauren's always dangerous on the outside, uh, getting forward and getting herself into dangerous positions. And, and uh, on the stats, uh, you know, she didn't get an assist tonight, uh, but she did set up several goals for us today. So it unfortunately doesn't get in the stat column, but um, did a lot of, lot of things for us that were very good in setting up uh, other players. Um, and, and creating goal scoring opportunities and, and then other players that you know came off the bench, you know, Becky Freeman still uh, is a very important figure for us, whether she's in the starting lineup or coming off the bench, um, to provide us with goal scoring opportunities and, and good to see Michaela Martinez get the first goal tonight. Um, she's a player that's kind of been rein, reinserted into the lineup over the last three games um, and been playing very well. And so we, we really look for her to um, continue to do that and glad that she was able to find a back of the net tonight. So um, we've got a number of different op options up front um, in our attack that can find uh, scoring opportunities and put those away. And so that's really a luxury that we have this year is that we're not really dependent on one player um, as we kind of have been in, in past years.